Everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play XCOM Terror from the Deep. And when we last left off, we were eliminating Gilman under the sea. And more Gilman remained to be found and destroyed by the power of our XCOM operatives. We know there's someone over here somewhere. So we're going to continue our search through the wilderness until we find all who stand against us. My hunch was right. I threw a grenade there, and there's a a gill man right next to it. And that is the end of the mission. There you go. A score bonus of 101. A significant score bonus. We apparently don't have enough equipment to re-equip our squad, but that's not no problem. For now, we have bumped ourselves up. All the way up to minus 500, which is good. We also got excellent progress on that. Another large. We shall attempt to shoot down this large. And that was the one I was thinking of. No, no, just select your target, straight to the base. <coughs> Missed it. Alright, um, will we get the research? Let's check out our submarine at least. Tick has been upgraded to enable seamen from having three kills. That's good. Talk. Nothing. Alright, well at least one promotion's better than nothing. How's our submarine going? Thermal tasers are a bit out of action, and chemical flares are a bit low too. So we should purchase some more of each. <coughs> Enough storage space, again. Time to sell some more aquaplastics and bodies. We also don't need 102 sonic pulses, let's be honest. I think 50 is a more sensible number. I'll make it 60. Uh, anything else? Probably don't need that much zerbite, but it is unique. Cool. Now can we purchase our thermal tasers and sonic pulses, please? Sorry, chemical flares. No, we can't. Oh well. Generally satisfying? That's good. Monthly rating of minus 401. Sorry, minus 241. Yeah, I can count. Um, we've actually got a generally satisfied report. The Euro Syndicate, Africa Corps, Asian Coalition and Scandinavia are particularly happy with my progress in dealing with their local inc alien incursion and have agreed to increase their funding. Now, molecular control training. Everyone can go in. Uh, we've got an improvement of 5 and 6 on our two troops. Research is also complete. On the f we now know what the fleet supply cruiser is. Thank you, technician. We totally needed to know that. We're just interrogating these people pointlessly, but hey. All right, it's now December, and we instantly get a terror site. We have no option but to respond to the terror site, and it's a shipping loot route one. We remember the shipping routes, don't we? Yes, we do. We do! It's a good opportunity to get a great hole in our score, or a very nice start to our score, whichever is which. And I forget how long in it. Let's just do it. Yeah, let's just do it. Uh, alien activity site 9. A bug hunt. Two levels! It's basically the size of a base, except more annoying. Okay, we have our alien blasters. We'll equip our thermal tasers. We're definitely going to need chemical flares. Although being a semi-indoor mission, it isn't as bad, but yeah. We're going to need to play it cagely. Last time we had one of these, we ended up with two troopers left. But the two troopers survived, and we were proud of them. So, you know, they were, they were good troops. 
Once again, we need to carry with us whatever we do, we're not going to use. We're out of clips for Sonic Blasters, so I guess these two get the Disruptor Pulse launchers. They're the great best thing to use on a civilian mission because you're guaranteed to kill civilians at the same time. Yeah, I like it that way. Alright. Probably one of these days I should like get medikits again. Just reminded me reminded of medikits after last mission. Okay. Is it a trap? Not yet. Okay. It's a bit different to hear the sound of the sea lanthanth over the, the land, but hey. Tick. The first one of a chemical flare that shall be used this mission. She'll throw her chemical flare over here. Excellent work. We have encountered a civilian. A wild civilian. We can't see anything at all. That's why we're trying to use chemical flares. You can't throw over the sub, can you? Of course not. And you missed. Isn't that nice? Well, Tuck, where Tick has failed, you can succeed. Wonder if it's went on top of the trite. That's fantastic. Alright, well, let's throw yours over here. Excellent work. Now, can you see anything else? Nope. Nope, the tank can't. The light level is pretty low. And I forget how good it's going to be inside. I will see. We will see. I'm also aware that we do need to get to the, um, the doors as soon as possible. Lots of sonic weaponry there. Many civilians falling into the dust. Isn't that nice? Okay. Tuck, make a break for it. Couldn't make it all the way, but hey, it was a good break. Just checking the inside of that little corner. Don't want any love games at all on this mission. Because from any corner and any angle could be an alien hiding, waiting for us to find it and kill it. Tick can make a break for it too. Alright, um, what else? That's all for this turn. I'd like to know what I'm dealing with. Aquatoids. Ah, oh, aquatoids. You might even see some Zar squids this mission. That'd be different. Well, aquatoids bring, bring with them a feeling of safety and yet a feeling of despair. Um, yes, these two feelings can exist quite happily co- uh, can quite happily coexist, rather. This is because um, aquatoids will, of course, wield dangerous weapons. But on the other hand, aquatoids will also um, fall pretty easily to most things. Um, you can take a shot, apparently. Apparently. So, let's just leave you to do your thing. Bush Tucker, could you provide a grenade here? It's funny to see them without their helmets on. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. We could just disrupt a pulse launch to the whole roof, but that's just going to end in tears. Although, it could end in tears. Yeah, I'm, I'm tempted. Let's do it. Brave toenails, bravely launch your brave torpedo. Oh, it's an underwater weapon. Ah, I forgot. All right. Well, let's not waste it. We have two people who aren't armed, but that's not a problem because I'm sure someone will die and conveniently leave their gun. Or we'll find some ammunition. Either that or the enemy will provide some ammo for you guys. Alright, well everyone's blocking the door quite nicely there. Alright, wet chicken. Wet chicken is ready and poised. And you know why she's, he or she is poised? Uh, he? 
Yeah, he's poised because we're about to end this video. So when we come back, we'll continue this ship terror site. That's right, it's a ship.